states that this video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. If you break the rules, I'll eat your entire planet. All right, guys, today again, I'm not putting my face on camera because I'm rather unkempt right now. But I've been looking for this set for about a year now. At Toys R Us, they had the uh, 2007 movie version of Starscream, Bumblebee, and Optimus Prime. And I wasn't interested in that. So I went online and the price ranged from 20 to 30 bucks. And so I'm, you know, scalpers again, thank you. Today I went to Walmart, I walked outside of the toy aisle and I went to check for uh, Hot Wheels for my son and I saw this, 797 Canadian. So those, this is the Jada uh, metal die cast nano Hollywood rides. Uh, this is not Hollywood, but Unless the 1986 movie is considered a Hollywood movie, I don't know. Collector diecast series, uh, NV4, I have no clue what that means. The Transformers, Heroic Robot, and a Decepticon. Uh, More than meets the eyes. So Jada did good. Original uh, box art, and then all the mumbo jumbo. So yeah, I'm very happy to open this up. So let me open it and uh, take a look at it. And they're out of the box and then just uh, to explain I just did a review about those and I haven't uh, put them on any shelf yet so I figured and eh, why not so you can check my review of these guys it's the same company Jada toys and uh, they do wonderful stuff sorry for any MISB collector because yeah there's really no way to open this up without ripping it apart uh, but you know I I'm not a MISB but this, this is rather cool Good representation of Bumblebee, the Autobot logo, some paint application for the headlight, the bumper, the wheels, you know, there's no robot jogment you can see inside on those. Uh, tinted window, you know, nice little bumper. Uh, wheels, they look like they can roll. Yeah, this is a soft surface. Hey, you know what? Here's a mouse pad, which is completely dirty. But I'm pretty sure that if I roll this, yep, I don't know if you can see it on camera. Uh, let me move this a little bit. There you go. And if you look, it rolls. Pretty good. You know what? I'm going to keep it handheld. Um, oh, sorry about my thumb. I just uh, scraped it doing my back end. Uh, Optimus Prime looking really good. I like the, uh, the window. Uh, the paint application, the details is pretty good at this scale. The details on the wheel, pretty nice too. And China Autobot underneath, if you look at it when it rolls. Uh, the front wheel, uh, there you go, there you go. Not bad. Sorry for the quality of the uh, image, uh, but at this height it's uh, kind of hard. Uh, and then you have Starscream, who also has, well, landing gear. So that's better than any Earthrise mold we've had so far. Uh, look at the details on this. The silver, the yellow for the cockpit, and then the metallic red on the wings and the uh, air intakes. Pretty good. The fins at the end, fairly detailed. I like uh, the, uh, the molding on this one. It's really good. Really like the tail end here. It's great, and I don't know if this one's gonna roll uh, or if you guys are gonna be able to see it. Yeah, you can't really see it. They're really tight, honestly. The uh, no. this one rolls, but these two at the back, they uh, they don't, or actually they don't feel like they do. But pretty good. So let's go back. Sorry about the professionalism of this review, but I was too excited pass up this opportunity to show off these uh, these little guys they're really good and uh, one last shot of each of them you know they're really small and even if it's the same company that made them uh, than these figures you can tell that well you know what the chest is pretty much the same size so I guess the scaling is okay there might be a little mass shifting but 
Uh, he looks like uh, he's taller. He's heavier anyway. But if you look at the chest, it's there's not much of a gap. And then Bumblebee. I don't know if it scales. Yeah, it's... The Autobot logo is not at the same spot. Uh, but still, it's pretty neat. Uh, go back. Uh, go back. Of course, knock everything down. And then Starscream. Uh... Yeah, the wings are about the same size. So yeah, I guess it scales pretty good. That's good on uh, on Jada's part. I like that. So there you go, guys. My super quick review of uh, the Jada um, Hollywood Nano Hollywood rides, uh, Transformers. Really happy to have these. And uh, eventually I'll uh, snap a picture of uh, Omega Supreme in base mode with all these guys on it. And I'll put it up on my Instagram. So thanks for stopping by, guys. I really appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed the, this quick review. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. I love reading those. And remember, nothing in life gives you the right to be an asshole. Take care.